At a doctor's office in China Grove, North Carolina, a man waits for his doctor. Hello. Hey. How are you, Mr. Joseph? He's doing good. How are you today, Doc? Oh, not bad. What's going on today? Oh, I just think I had a sinus infection. Maybe you noticed the good doctor is wearing the standard issue physician jumpsuit. Yes, twice a day. You want From to... outer space. Yeah, that's looking pretty bad. Okay. This is Dr. Eric Troyer, a family doctor with a twist. He's normal doctor, dude. Well, yeah. he's not a normal person. <laughs> but... Well, actually, it's more of a warp, as in... I had warp factor two, Mr. Sulu. Warp factor two, sir. And what kind of reaction have you been, have you been getting? Mixed. <laughs> Somewhere between the nurse's station and the exam room. So people can walk by without actually walking in. Is this museum <laughs> Welcome. dedicated to Star Trek? <laughs> what did you think when you came in? This was a, the procedure room. I um, used to do minor procedures in here, but it's never a good room. The floor is uneven, the bed didn't sit level. So, so why not turn it into a, a Star, Star Trek, Trek museum? Room? Why not? <laughs> Hang on, Doc. You went to the auction? The auction. What auction? Christie's, New York City. The big shot auction. The big shot auction. Is some of this stuff real? All of it's real. Yes, folks, these are the genuine articles. These are all so you're a serious lunatic. I mean, you're a yes. money spending. Yes, it's, it's Transporter from the Enterprise series. I went ahead and recorded the sound effects so that I can play with the buttons and pretend to be doing all that. Scotty wore this Scotty in the first movie. Sulu wore that in the first Sulu movie. Sulu wore that in the first movie. This is not normal. Okay. This is a little odd. This is a little odd. It's funny, it's okay. fun, but a little strange. On a stressful day, I come here and this is my haven. <laughs> Honestly, it is mostly men that really, really do like it. Yeah, Dr. Troyer's nurses, they don't completely get it. I mean, I can't honestly relate because I don't get into Star Trek stuff, so. No matter, his patients, they love him and swear by him. As long as he didn't get his tricorder out to take care of it. <laughs> <you know. laughs>